Residents of the Verdanville village in Arima have received a pipe-borne supply of water for the first time. According to residents, for many years they have had to rely on a nearby river for water to do their laundry and to take baths before heading to work and school. At a ceremony hosted by Wasa, the Minister of the Environment and Water Resources, Ganga Singh, said water for all is still one of the government's top priorities. Mahalia Joseph has more in this report. Minister of the Environment and Water Resources Ganga Singh says the water project in the village was completed in three months at a cost of $4.8 million. He says approximately 200 residents who never had a steady supply of water will benefit from the project. I take it Arima means water. And how come we have to do so many projects in Arima after all these years? It is clear that there was not a coherent vision, a consistent plan, and a love for people required to give them this basic right, this human right. One resident and former councillor for the village, Vidya Mahabir, gave a recollection of her experiences without water as a child. Before we leave to go to school as children, we would have to fill barrels if we do get the river clean we would have to fill barrels because when the, the quarry is there and all that slush washes down into the river, that was our only means of water. And if we didn't fill that barrel before the quarry started to work, we had no water to wash or to do whatever. She even explained how they would get clean water if the river was filled with slush from a nearby quarry. We would have to take, dig upon at the side of the river so that the water would filter and come up clean so we would have water to wash. That is the plight of villages like these. It's very, very terrible. And um, it was hard work for, for the children. Minister Singh says the government's investment has resulted in 73% of the population receiving a 24-7 water supply. In 2010, only 18% of the population received a steady supply of water. Mahalia Joseph, C News.